Hello, everybody. So today, uh, what we're going to be talking about uh, is using the circle tool. And so you're going to be able to create something that looks like this after you understand how to use the circle tool. Okay, so what I'm going to go ahead and do is just delete all of these features. And so let's start from scratch. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and select the top face or the top plane uh, for my sketch plane. And so now I have the top plane selected. Uh, what you'll see is there's this tool right here, which is the center point circle. If I press this drop down, it will give me different options. So there's also a three point circle. Uh, that's where you basically just uh, click to indicate the starting point. Then you click to indicate the second point, And then you click to indicate the third or final point. Uh, and then right here, this is the ellipse. So if you want something that is not actually uh, perfectly round, you know, you might want the radius to be differing, um, then you can click on ellipse. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and select the center point circle. And so I'm going to go ahead and click my first point, and then all you do is just click the second point. Okay, so in this, uh, if we want to change the diameter, uh, right here, this zero with a slash through it, that actually stands for a diameter. So that is the diameter of our current 